Porch 300, sir. For Chief Petty Officer Terrell Horn, going to work each day was never without risk, as NBC News saw this past May. It's mostly night work, looking for these Panga-style open boats, the boat of choice for those smuggling drugs or undocumented immigrants from Mexico. Just after midnight Sunday, Horn and his crew lowered a small inflatable like this one from their 87-foot cutter Halibut to pursue a Panga boat running without lights, when suddenly that boat turned and rammed Horn's vessel. The impact left Horn with a fatal head injury and his shipmates devastated. He's the best shipmate I've ever known. He was a friend. He was a big brother to us all, and he's absolutely irreplaceable. The waters off California's Channel Islands have become a favorite transit point for smugglers, and on average, there are sightings of those panga boats every third day. Horn, a husband and father, had never shied away from hazardous duty. He'd been credited with saving 38 lives in 63 search and rescue missions. At the end of today, everything I've told you about Chief Horn should tell you what an amazing person he was. He was a leader. He was a friend, he was a mentor, and he was a shipmate, and we will dearly miss him. Please allow his family and the Coast Guard to mourn the loss of this wonderful chief. That panga boat, like this one, was located by helicopter and intercepted. Two suspects detained and now in custody. But they left behind a casualty of their particular war. Terrell Horn, a hero, dead at 34. Mike Taibbi, NBC News, Los Angeles.